Hey guys, welcome back to Feeding Hair Loss. My name is Steve. Tonight, we're gonna to talk about shampoos. Yeah, we're gonna talk about shampoos. I like to kind of smile tongue in cheek and call this potions and lotions. Get a lot of questions about, well, what kind of shampoo can I use to stop my hair loss? The answer is really nothing. You know, shampoos, potions, and lotions really don't do anything. This is something, at least in the male body specifically, that's derived from your mom and dad, or maybe your grandpa, grandfather, uncles, your ancestors. It was predisposed at birth on what follicles on your head are gonna to start to fall out at a certain time in your life. Not too fun for me, it's not too fun for you. So the first question before we accept that we're actually going bald is maybe I should change my shampoo. Well, I am an absolute nut job. I'm a freak about hair loss. I have gone to the ends of the earth to try to figure out how to help people out there after what I went through. And guess what? I use Dove shampoo. Dove shampoo. Um, you can get this anywhere. Any supermarket in the country, you can get this in any pharmacy. This is Dove conditioner. It's probably $3.50 per bottle. If there's anything out there that can possibly help with hair loss or help your hair grow better, I'm the one that's going to use it. Trust me. Now, I'm also pretty frugal. I'm not cheap, but I'm kind of frugal. And, you know, I don't like to spend a lot of money on like perfumey stuff and kind of like what the hair salon person tells you to use, like $50 for a little bottle. Oh, it's going to help you with your hair loss. Pay no attention to that. If you have to use something, if you desperately want to start with a potion or lotion, okay, you got me. You've got to Google, go to probably Amazon, get a shampoo with copper in it. Copper has some anecdotal evidence that it can help with hair loss. It's gonna be expensive, you know, the copper peptide thing, but if it has copper in it, then maybe that'll do it for you. I haven't really seen anybody really successful with that, but if it makes you feel better about it, go ahead and try that. The second thing is Nizorol shampoo, N-I-Z-O-R-A-L, got it? Nizorol shampoo can, um, you know, use it two or three times a week. It's more like a dandruff shampoo, but it has some evidence that it can also help with that hair loss. So while you're going through those initial stages, before you jump on any medications, because you haven't seen a specialist or even your family doctor, you can go out and get yourself some copper filled shampoo. You go out and get yourself some Nizorol. Don't use Nizorol every day. But if you want to follow me down the path, you know, we'll talk about that medication to preserve your hair and grab a little Dove shampoo. I don't know, just my hair's been through the ringer, but this seems to do it for me. So, hey, I hope this helps out there with everybody looking for some sort of potion or lotion because it's kind of your mom and dad, so to say. It's not your shampoo you're using, but whatever makes you feel comfortable, I'm cool with, as long as you don't go messing up your hair with some sort of chemical. Hey, I hope this helps all you out there. Don't forget to like and subscribe.